What is going on guys, this is Austin, and today I am bringing you a video that I probably should have done yesterday because I spent all day playing this game. I wanted to test it out before I went to recording, but holy shit, Notruff112 is by far my favorite single player emergency services game. Now, the reason I say single player is because Emergency 4 still got everybody beat with the multiplayer. Can't beat it. Emerge, you're slacking on both ends. But no trophy homo too, you are coming in hard. And and this is a very complete, slightly buggy, but you know what? Game's not even really out completely yet. Multiplayer is very buggy in this game. Uh, you can kind of drive around. Uh, sometimes it breaks. Um, but you got all the stuff on the trucks. Um, so right now, I'm actually assigned to this one here, the... the TLF, uh, I'm not really, oh, alright, we're getting a call, um, so I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna do the attack squad leader, so we're actually gonna be riding in the back of the truck, so, we're getting our call right now, it is German, but, LF24, RTV1, NEF1, I can switch in and out of, uh, first and, third person. So now the station alarms are going off, so we're riding in this boy right here. I'm gonna go ahead and just, uh, how did I do this last time? I guess we're, I'm gonna ride backwards. There we go. Alright. So, uh, we're in route for a road traffic accident with a person trap. So the AI is actually really good in this game, and that is something I cannot, uh, I don't know why my mouse is on the right monitor, I'm not sure. There we go, alright, uh, it's on my left monitor, not my right monitor. Alright, so anyways, this game is awesome. So right now, we're, we're running to this call. We've got one, two guys next to me, we've got a third guy. Over in the corner. Alright. Looks like we're on scene. We have to wait till all personnel are arrived. Uh, probably an ambulance and maybe another engine. So let's go ahead and get this started. Let's get out of here. We'll wait for further instructions. So. Alright. Well, we, I guess, are doing the fun stuff today. We're going to get the hydraulic spreaders out. So, as you can see, there's a lot going on here. So, you know, animation could use a little help, but... Other than that, I mean, there's animations. He's So, he's gonna cut the battery. He just cut the battery. Isn't that fucking sweet? Like... And, uh, we're gonna work on getting... Um, some new skins for the game. Um, that way they're kind of Americanized. Um, so we just cribbed the vehicle. So now we're still waiting for instructions. So you can see the AI is ready. So we got fire extinguisher and a hose line for any cutting. Probably a guy back there on the pump. Uh, we got our supervision guys so he's spreading that right now so I kind of missed it but uh, alright so he took the the Halligan and oh, hold on let me grab the fetters real quick so this is I mean like this is really cool we switch seamlessly in between first and third person So now we're cutting this, uh, the bolt. And now, watch, so we're gonna prep this next one. So we're gonna pick up the Halligan, walk around here. Trying to show you the animation. Alright, well, I think I was a little off. But essentially, what I did was I just made a little gap there for him. So you can see, we can set down our tools, we can pick them up. 
and this truck is a working toolbox as you can see he had, the, the one guy came up with a uh, with a set of pliers so you know it it's very uh, this game is really neat I really I really enjoy it personally so it's so now we just did the so I'm gonna go ahead and set this start putting some stuff back because it says to wait for further instructions but sometimes helping the game out is nice to do so you can see like we have everything we have a rescue ramp we have foam we have like foam hose we have oh I have to cut shit what am I cutting oh we're doing a Complete roof removal. Interesting. As you can see, whatever the hell he's supposed to be wearing is kind of glitchy. So, this game is getting there, and that's something that's very important for people to, to understand is that this game is. In terms of, like, uh,. I don't want to say like a kill death ratio, but I mean like, you know, uh, success to failure ratio. This game is phenomenal. Like, its success rate is fantastic, and just to have a couple bugs is, is nothing. I mean, once they get, get ironed out, then yeah, this game can be something really neat, but in terms of now, I mean, this thing is, it's really entertaining. The bugs are not game breaking. So, it's really important that people know how to, um, I don't want to say diagnose, but when you look at an issue, you got to be able to problem solve. So, like, for example, if your guy bugs out, well, just switch to another guy, because AI can debug itself. So now we're going to grab some binding agent, so we'll get this one opened up, grab the binding agent here, and we're going to walk over, so you can see that I'm walking slower now because I'm carrying a 50 pound bag of uh, oil dry or binding agent or whatever. So my, my friend over here is going to go grab the broom. A similar game to this would have been uh, Firefighters 2014, which was back in the day. And uh, that game is very similar, it's just this is like the modern version. Pretty sure. I'm just going to help them out with this. I don't need that necessarily. Trying to put that on, didn't like that. So, as you can, I mean, I can switch to third person. But I really, I really like first person in this game because it's it's so complete. I mean, like as you saw when I went to uh, do uh, the closing of the doors, sometimes it just doesn't like it. Um, but you know, in, in terms of uh, Really, what this this game is about—it's really complete.
I'm really a fan of this game. Like, so what I think I'm gonna do is once we get back to the station, I'll uh, I'll pause it, uh, and then I'll just do it. I'll resume the next time we get a call. I'll maybe do two calls, and then that'll be an episode. Or this, I mean, this could be a ten-minute episode. We'll just wait till we get back, and I can. Yeah, you, know, you guys can let me know what you what you like about this game and what you don't. And, you know, if you want to see it become a uh, official, you know, uh, thing on my channel. I'm really I'm really liking this. Um, you know, so like we're waiting in traffic right now, and like like in real life, you don't fight fires every day, so or structure fires. You might get a dumpster fire, a car fire, a truck fire. The the one thing I don't like about this game. I'll be honest, is the fire animation is kind of shit. But, that's all they gotta fix. It's just some, uh, not animation, but the texturing behind it's kind of garbage. So once they fix the texturing, that's it. So, you know, then you really got, and, you know, I don't know, I, th I think it's great. This game is good so far. I, the textures are a little lower for me because I turned down uh, them so that we could I think the view distance isn't on a hundred and things, shit like that because I wanted to be able to record with eight fucking frames and have no issues. So. So that was that. So now the mission doesn't ever end until all units are back in quarters. But this was really nice. I think what I'm going to do, we'll wait till the mission ends. You know, even you can see that sometimes the AA backs in a little crooked like in real life. So it's really neat. This tower truck is massive. This, this ladder is incredible. Um, Alright, so everybody made it back. That took 11 minutes. So I am impressed with that. Um... You know, this shows you, like, essentially what you would have typed up. But, uh, I think we'll pause it, we'll leave it there, and, uh, you guys let me know what you like about this game, what you don't like, and if you want to see more. And if you want to see some different colors on the trucks, you let me know, I can make different skins and things like that. I think even I can customize the roll doors, so, I will, uh, I'll look into it, because it could be something, it could be pretty neat, but... You guys let me know what you like about this game, if you want to see it become a, not really a series, because I don't really do series, but if you just want to see me play it on the channel, you guys let me know in the comments, and, uh, of course, like the video. And if you are new here, feel free to subscribe, I do lots of videos per week. I will see you guys next time. Thank you. Have a good day.